Good to see you again. Watch your damn self. Oh, you think you're real scary, huh? I'll show you scary. Come on, little boy. Let's settle this like men. No need to thank that hard. It's just you know what? You're on. I'll be doing the world a favor. Come on, let's go outside. Yeah. I've seen everything. You made a big mistake disrespecting me. Come far today? Sure looks like it. They weren't Christians, so I said. So you here for the auction? Because my advice would be to steer well clear of the fellow who runs that auction yard. Morris Payton's his name. Crooked as a dog's hind leg. More of a friend of the rustlers than any working man. And does Sheriff Malloy do anything about it? Of course he don't. They're all in it together. Anyways, I can see you ain't interested in any of this, so I'll just shut my mouth. Goddamn America. More goddamn shots. More goddamn prissy women in men's clothing hey, look, and women in women's clothing told you thinking garbage. they must be men. You ain't welcome in this town my no more. Bessie, she could skin a bear with her teeth, so help me God. Look at you. Y'all make a fella sick! Just get out of my way. Hey, welcome here. You're a sad old fool, huh? At least I'm a goddamn man. All right, you ain't scared don't nobody. Try to cut it hey, are you blind? Hey, take a deep breath or two, huh? This place is bad. I've had it. I've seen it all. Why don't you mind? My spot ain't no place for this nonsense. Quit it. Good gracious. around here every day.
Oh no. Well, My okay. trouble days are being Come on, belly up. Stop there a minute, will you? I don't think you want to start with me, friend. Out of the damn way! Steer clear of that hey, one! Think about this. Keep yeah, calm. I'm Let me take care of you. You're gonna regret this. Oh my Hands God! Hands up now! Right. You win. Think about this now. You Come along you easy. with a bullet. Put a rock in the middle of the road. Hey, you there? I would you mind watching my stuff while I head to find another wagon? Uh, sure. You were kind, man. I'll be back, fit as a fiddle. Boss ain't gonna be happy about this. Maybe sit down and wait it out, huh? Appleseed is very unhappy. Mr. Appleseed ain't out here getting mauled by wolves. We lost two men already. Ugh! What's your good for nothing, cowards? Yeah, yeah. Call yourselves lumbermen, afraid of us, few damn critters. It's a forest. What the hell do you expect? Hey, partner. 
Oh! Yes, yes! Maybe you're the man I need! Can you believe these lazy lily livers? Refusing to work on account of a few little wolves? They've been attacking workers on the south side of the camp. We need a real man to get rid of them. What do you say? You'll be very well rewarded. All right. If you're paying, I should be able to take care of that for you. Hey, mister. Hello. Hey, he's he there. Here.
Let's go, girl. Yeah. Shots and howling, you got some good news for me? Yep, it's done. <laughs> That's a relief, I'll tell you. Excellent work. Money's right there on the table. Don't mention it. Me and wolves go way back. I'm leaving. Don't work too hard. There ain't much danger of that with this bunch, my friend. All right, you lazy bastards. You get back to work first thing in the morning. The wolves are gone, so no more excuses. Hey, Arthur. Good to see you. Why? You want rescuing again, do you? <laughs> no. I got a plan to make it up to you. A plan like the Blackwater Ferry job, or like you going off scouting and ending up in jail? <laughs> Dutch said you was a, a big shadow cast by a tiny tree. I don't even know what that means. Mm, I thought you was a tough boy. <laughs> Not one of those gentlemen. <laughs> trying to protect his riding clothes. I just know whenever things get real, you turn yellow and lose your head. Yellow? Sure seems that way. So I guess you won't be riding with me to rob the banking coach comes about this time in the strawberry. I heard one of the O'Driscoll boys yapping about it while I was inside. You and me do robbery? That's what I said, didn't I? After you. <laughs> Come on. I know an overlook where we can watch for them coming in. Girl. <laughs> what are you doing anyway, camping out here like some crazy hermit? Can't exactly stay in town now, can I? And like I told you, I ain't going back to Dutch without a peace offering. Clock ticking, Morgan. Let's go. Hey, what are you getting off for? So, you were saying? So what's the deal with this coach? What do you mean? Comes through about this time every day, like I said, the end. I mean, how many men? Guns. Riders. Nothing serious. It'll be fine. I heard the bank's been hiring every trigger man they can get of late. The meaner, the better. You worry too much. Forgive me if I ain't wholly faithful in something an old Driscoll told you when you was half drunk in a jail cell. He kept yapping about it, saying how they've been hitting it on the regular. That's a good lead in my book. Damn old Triscolls are everywhere now. Bastards got a hold of most of Big Valley. Heard they took over some big ranch north of here. How the hell you and Lenny end up down here anyway? Oh, you know how it is? A few loose ends, drink here, drink there. What loose ends? Nothing that needs to concern you. I always pay my share. It concerns me. When you put us in danger and we don't realize till it's too late. Like that move you pulled in Strawberry. Making me kill half the town just for your precious guns. Precious they are. You need to roll a little looser, Morgan. Looser? I seen you come full undone more than once now. And you only been running with us a few months. Are we gonna rob this coach or bicker about it? What's done is done. Guess we're robbing him. 
Then let's do it. This is the spot. Hold up on this ridge. They should be here in a little bit. Hold tight. Which way will they be coming in? Should be from over there. We need to hit them fast before they get into town. Just don't lose your head this time. Of course, tough guy. They should be here. Any minute. Look, here they are. Right on time. Get covered up. Come on! <laughs> right! Yeah. Keep your face covered now. It's just you and me, sweetheart. I'll give it to them. They put up half a fight at least. Yeah! Hey, luck! Come on, boy! Mm. Here. Find new rifle, too. Here you go, Arthur. From me to you, that's more your style than mine. What did I tell you? Like licking butter off a knife. Something like that. You don't want to just break it open here, be done with it? Could be more than we can carry. And there might be a second crew of riders tailing. All right, then. Not to mention, we ride back in with a big tank and a new wagon to boot. Dutch can't say we ain't pulling our weight no more, can he? I ain't sure I trust this new act of yours one bit. Listen, I know we got off on the wrong foot, but I got no beef with you. I reckon we're a lot alike, you and me. Now, hold up there. Dutch knows I'm a feller that gets things done, same as you. Gets things done? You'd be wearing California collar now if I hadn't broken you out of jail. And I have expressed my gratitude, have I not? It's done. Main thing now is getting this haul back in one piece.
why is it every job I do with you ends in a pile of dead bodies? Since when did you have a problem killing old Driscoll? Huh, huh. You've got a point. Let's strip this coach, then. It clearly ain't going nowhere now. Let's take what we can and get the hell out of here. That lock should shoot off easy enough. I'll give you the honors. On account of, well, this little mess. Go up. That should do it. Come on, let's see if all this was worth All I see is you, me, a river full of dead O'Driscolls, and a lockbox. I'd say we're golden here, Morgan. Look at that. What's the cut here? It's good. Just make sure the gang gets its peace. Yeah, yeah. Like I said, big shadow. Tiny tree. And like I said, that still don't mean nothing. Get out of here. Go see Dutch. Make sure you ain't followed. I know, boss. I know. It's been fun! Yeah.